period of question number 1.241 in this question we have given that a uniform disc of radius r is equal to 20 cm has a round cut as shown in the figure the mass of the remaining portion of the disc equals m is equal to 7.3 kg we have to calculate the moment of inertia of such a disc relative to the axis passing through its center of inertia and perpendicular to the plane of the disc now i am going to solve this question given mass in the question is of shaded portion so the area density of the shaded portion is suppose sigma that is equal to mass of the shaded portion divided by the area of the shaded portion and its value is 4m divided by 3 pi r square we consider the given system in the question as superposition of two complete disc one of the positive density and radius r and other of negative density but of same magnitude and radius r by 2 now after superposition we get a disc which is given in the question Here I am using a concept of negative mass but there is no any existence of concept of negative mass. It is just a logic to solve this question. I am repeating here. There is no any existence of concept of negative mass. It is just a logic to solve the question. Now we have to calculate the respective masses of the considered disk. So suppose this bigger disc is disc number 1 and the smaller disc is disc number 2. First of all, uh, we have to calculate the mass of the bigger disc. Suppose this mass is M1 and its value is the mass density divided by, sorry, multiplied by the area of this bigger disk and its value is 4m divided by 3 now the mass of smaller disk of negative mass density is mass density multiplied by the area of this smaller disk so its outcome is m divided by 3 but uh, this mass is of negative density so this mass is negative let us take O as a origin and uh, x axis towards right and actually body is symmetric about x axis so center of mass of this system lie on the x axis so the center of mass of the given shaded portion is given as x sim means position of center of mass sorry x coordinate of the position of center of mass is mass of the bigger disk into the position of center of mass of the bigger disk in the system with respect to point O that is taken as origin plus mass of the smaller disk into the position of the smaller disk in the system with respect to point O divided by this 4m by 3 mass number 1 minus mass number 2 
and its value is r divided by 6. So the center of mass of the given system is at a distance r by 6 from the point O towards x axis. So suppose this point is the center of mass and this is taken as C. Now using parallel axis theorem and keeping in mind that the moment of inertia of a complete homogeneous disk of mass m0 and radius r0 equals half m0 r0 square the moment of inertia of the small disk of mass minus m by 3 this one and radius r by 2 about the axis passing through point c and perpendicular uh, to the plane of the disk is so this is i2a sorry i2c that is equal to half sorry this i2c is equal to this i2c is equal to half m r square sorry radius square of the radius plus m d square so mass is m by 3 into the value of d is r by 2 plus r by 6 so it's a square so this value is minus m r square divided by 24 minus 4 divided by 27 m r square now similarly we are going to calculate the moment of inertia of the large body with respect to point c is equals to half m r square so the mass of the bigger disk is 4m divided by 3 and its radius is r so half m r square plus m d square m is again 4m by 3 and the value of d is r by 6 so its value is 2 by 3 m r square 2 by 3 m r square plus 4 m divided by 3 into r square by 36 this is the moment of inertia of the given system about point c is the sum of i2c plus i1c this is minus m r square divided by uh, 24 minus 4 divided by 27 m r square plus 2 by 3 m r square plus m r square by 27 this is m r square divided by 27 and its value is 1 1 1 divided by 24 into 9 m r square and this value is 37 divided by 72 m r square and this is our answer so uh, this is the solution of uh, this question please like and share the video to help other students find us for further updates please subscribe the channel thank you for watching